this is going to be weeks and, and months to sort through to sort through this all. Father Bob Steck, pastor of St. Ambrose Church, has been a big part of the healing process in the city of Brunswick. Three of the four teens in last week's fatal car accident attended his church. The outpouring of support has come from all over the place. And again, I think, you know, I think um, in moments of difficulty, in moments of dress, there's just, uh, I think people realize that we're all looking for something to do. Much of that outpouring has come from neighboring communities like Strongsville. Brunswick and Strongsville high schools have always been longtime rivals. Anytime we play them, it's a big deal. Um, but at the same time, we want to support them. We have a lot of respect for each other as teams and as communities. For now, that rivalry has been set aside. Brianna Heilman is a recent Strongsville High School graduate. She, along with her friends, made special signs to let their Brunswick neighbors know that they are in their prayers. There's ribbons all over Strongsville High School, down Pearl Road, um, just everywhere to show them that we are here for them and we'll do whatever we can to help them out in their time of need. Putting up a ribbon or a sign may seem like a little thing, but it never goes unnoticed. All of us are always one. And, uh, and these are moments where we separate uh, what we do like on the field or what we do in terms of other competitive things. And we, uh, we really rally together to show support. In Brunswick, I'm Dave Kapinski, News Channel 5.